Hello, so we are streaming. Hello. Hello, internet. Hi, everyone. How are you? It's us girls today. So, so we are slightly more organised than our counterpart, but only slightly. So, don't panic. So, uh, today we are streaming a bit of Lapland Solitaire to get everybody in the Christmas spirit, um, and then some Friday fantasy. Isn't it? Yeah, we thought we'd mix it up. I know you're all expecting Talisman, probably. So, <laughs> sorry to disappoint. Jazzing it up a bit. Yeah, we're going to play some Lapland Solitaire because we're getting the Christmas spirit. And I've got my Christmas jumper on. Yay! With a reindeer on too. Yeah, yeah, give it as a flash. Look! Oh. <laughs> my Christmas jumper! Okay. So, here we go. Well, it's December, and this is probably the last time I'll stream before Christmas. Yes, indeed. Yeah. I was thinking about that the other day, actually, because yeah. we'd have to sort of, you know, shut down for over Christmas. Yeah, we won't. There will be uh, probably not streaming uh, for two weeks over Christmas. So, yeah, sorry about that, guys. Network error. Oh, we've got a network error, so maybe we're not streaming. Hang on. That all goes wrong the minute Gareth leaves. <laughs> He's left us to it. We're probably talking to ourselves. There you go. I've, I, I've done the, the, gold, the good old trick of turning it off and on. <laughs> Hi, oh. Hi, Jill Shark. I can see your name there. Hi, Cheshire Cat Girl. Mm. I'm not too sure about this. Oh. We're not sure. We're not sure to do that. So maybe we're not live. Maybe we're just talking to ourselves. Yeah, it's quite obvious we're doing. Yeah. I don't know about it. Just as Gareth's left. Is it on YouTube? Yeah. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, that's a good point. Oh, so we, so so we are live. It's on YouTube. Someone can see us. So. Uh, yeah, we're there. Yeah. Can, so you, can anyone see us? Can you hear us? Please let us know. Let us know if you can see us. We can see us. Yeah. So can everybody else see us? Ooh. Poseidy. Poseidy86. Hello, Poseidy86, if you can see us. Oh, great. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for hey, the team. Yes. Excellent. <laughs> we're alive. We're um, here. Hi, Fishy. Did you all get to see my Christmas jumper? <laughs> if not, I'll have to show you again. <laughs> oh. So yeah, Reddit's Reddit's no good. Just instead of me going, yeah, yeah, you know, it's broke for me too. And you're like, cheers, Reddit. Yeah. <laughs> it's broke for us. We want a solution. <laughs> all right, okay. So we've got that. So that's all working. We're all working. <laughs> we think. Very well. So I think first things first, we will do the um, YouTube price drop. If that's okay with you, since I've got it up on the screen. Okay. Should, well, should we introduce ourselves first? Oh, I suppose that's a good idea. Yeah. Right, right. For those of you that haven't seen us. So I'm Bex. I'm marketing manager here at Nomad Games. I've streamed quite a few, but not so much recently, actually, because <laughs> Gareth's been loving it and everyone's been loving Gareth, so yeah. we've left him to it. He doesn't sound like he loves it. I'll come in and he's just like that. <laughs> mm. He does. I'm Amanda. Uh, I am uh, a junior artist. Yeah, and I come and help out on streams. So I think you chaps have seen you chat a couple of times. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Come and hang out for a bit. Because he's, he's off seeing his, his little kids' nativity. Yeah, because little nomad Christmas. kid. Yeah. He's, he's a sheep. He's a sheep. <laughs> he's off to, with his flock of sheep. Yes. So that should be good. Yeah. Maybe, maybe we can wash him up, you know, get yeah. some pictures. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. Yeah. Get some pictures. Uh, so, did anyone see my Christmas jumper? Talk about Christmas. Ooh, Christmas jumper. You'll have to read that. Anyway, I'm going to show you because it's jumping again. Because we're talking about Ooh. nativity. Yay. I've got my reindeer on! <laughs> I've, got, I've got a Star Wars Christmas jumper. Oh, Amanda's got a Star Wars Christmas jumper. Why are you not wearing it? Because uh, I'm saving it. Because I'm going when I go and see Star Wars, I'm going to be wearing my Star Wars uh, Christmas jumper. So you only wear the wear it once. Uh, what is that not like the point of Christmas jumpers? You tend to only really wear them once. Once? Oh, uh, yeah. No. <laughs> Every day in December. Hey, Fishy likes to jump off. Oh, thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Right, so we're going to do um, oh, the YouTube draw for last week. Yes. And what are they going to win? Uh, usually Gareth just goes, what would be fancy, give us a bell or something. All oh, right, okay. Hopefully. Hopefully. Something Christmassy. We'll let Gareth deal with that. All right, we'll let plan solitaire. Right, here we go. Random pick. Random pick. We've got a few people in the draw. Fishy! Oh! Hey. Do you know what? I'm a bloody twin. That's because you like the jumper. <laughs> <laughs> Faces. Gifted you. 
So it wasn't a fix, honestly. Okay. That was really funny. That was a total coincidence. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, I think I think maybe it's, maybe it's that one. But Fritchy, I can see you in the in the chat. So uh, give us a yell and we'll sort you out. Yeah, we'll give you a, a copy of. Lapland Solitaire. Yay! Which is a quite a good game. It's quite hard. It is good. I was playing it at lunch, trying to remember how to play it. How to yeah, play it. it is good. So we're going to put it on now. Oh, look at that! It looks so pretty. It's Don't quite, you think it looks so out. pretty? Yeah, it's quite, it is quite a nice, nice looking game. Now, which yeah. which we've we got a game capture on? Because I keep looking over there. Mm. So which so is, this one is so the is the game. This one is Twitch. Right. So this one I'll change around a bit. Yeah, we've changed the setup slightly since last time I was playing. So. <laughs> Hi Cheshire Cat Girl! How are you looking? They send us? No, you don't get free stuff. <laughs> uh, and, uh, we know who you are. Twas, twas bringing. I don't know how you pronounce it. I can never pronounce these things. Gear 1989, you've not missed anything. Uh, free cheers. He has missed something! He missed the Christmas jumper! <laughs> <laughs> you missed the Christmas jumper. There you go. Get over the Christmas spirit. Yeah, you've yeah. not missed anything now. So uh, and and uh, Fritchie, Fritchie has won the YouTube draw from last week. So yeah, excellent. We're giving away Lapland Solitaire today. Yes, you think so? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's okay. Christmas. Yeah. It's Christmas. Unless people really don't want it, but it's quite a good little game. Indeed. Are we going to play then? I think so. Yes. Do you want to take the controls or? Yeah, go on. So. I'll be controls. You know this, cause cause you, you, you can't read the screen from over there. You keep an eye on the chat. Right, we'll do. We'll chat. I'm just going to keep an eye on the chat. I'm going to play. Black Land Solitaire. Black Land Solitaire. So, so this is um, a nice little um, game that is based on the game Solitaire, but it's actually Christmas themed. Really? You can tell. I never guessed. If you hadn't said anything, I would clasp me by. You would. You would have thought it was like a summer yeah. sort of type game, wouldn't yeah. it? Yeah, with those beautiful hot snowmen. <laughs> so, yeah. So, we're going to play this. And the idea is you're counting down to Christmas. So, each day you've got to work your way through a card game and collect achievements and collect gold coins and help Santa build that land. Right. Which is why I like it. It's cute. <laughs> Right, let's Hello. play. Let's, let's play. Loading the festivities. Loading the festivities. So I did play the tutorial at lunch. So you can either start uh, a new game or just carry on from where I was. Oh, we'll carry on. So this is our landscape in Lapland Solitaire, right. and we've got to fill it up. Yeah. With lots of nice little Christmas buildings yeah. and Christmas trees and maybe some snowmen. Yeah. But the only way we can do that is by earning chocolate coins. Okay. And <laughs> um, the way you earn chocolate coins is by completing some solitaire games. So it are have you seen Carl's diorama? Yes. No. Oh Carl it's yeah. So it, it so so yes, I will explain the rules. Right, Carl. okay. So it's just like solitaire, so you kind of click higher or lower. Or may maybe maybe it's come back a bit. What? I thought I, this is the tutorial, I thought I'd played a bit. Oh, Come on, let's get out of the tutorial. Quit. Let's quit. Uh, I think I think that might I might not have a game save in my it. So we're we starting from the beginning. I think so. Alright. Okay. We're quitting. Yeah. We're quitting. After this, we're gonna play Fighting Fantasy Legends. So we're only <laughs> gonna do Yeah, yeah, I've got, do, I've got some I've got We're gonna do a few minutes time. of this. So, so. Right, we're playing. Is this out yeah. of the tutorial now? No, 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 I think I think it's I think I've my fault. What are you doing to me, Mandy? It, it, I it, was it, looking it, it so good. It didn't save, good. it didn't save, so I think you have to put it to the toilet. Oh, I have to put it Sorry. Sorry. <sighs> okay, we can't, can't get the staff. tutorial. We can't, can't get the staff, can you? No. It's just terrible. Right, so no. play the tutorial. So, yeah. So click either one higher or one lower than the top of your deck. So, I think what might have happened is... So we click here? Yeah. Go for it. And um, we can click here. Six, and then, and then seven. seven. Oh, this is a bit easy. Eight. Yeah, yeah. So click, 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 click. Remember, you can go down, down as well. Up. Oh, so Thank we can you. go eight. Thank you, Clippy. Seven, six, five. Oh, I'm glad I can count. Four, three, two, Ace. one. King. Thank you. Yeah, we know that. Thanks. Thank you. King. Thank so you. now we have won. Yay. So we've won. Go so we won. So here it tells you how many stars you've won and how many chocolate coins. Zero. Right. 
pumpkins tutorial. So this is day one in the morning, and then you have to play day one in the afternoon. Yeah, I was trying to, I was trying to like hundred percent it because I remember getting onto the lab, the third one. But on the third one, you've got like uh, cards that are like frozen. And uh, I was trying, to, I was trying to hundred percent it because I was just like, oh come on, this is such a simple game. Oh, right. So I'm stuck you, now. Stuck. Yeah, you so need I have to, to do the bottom turn deck. Turn over. So when you good. when you run out of cards on your little deck then uh, that's the end of the round. But the idea is you want to clear the whole thing, isn't it? Yeah, you want to try and clear it. It's slightly different from, like, you know, solitaire... King... 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 Oh, I should have done two. I'm going to go with that one. Oh. As you can tell, I'm really good at solitaire. <laughs> three! Here we go! Three! Two! two three! Three! Oh, it's not, I'm not like that one. Because you need to wait for it to flip because yeah. that's covered by the five. Ah, uh, it's covered by the five, it's sneaky. Queen, so, Queen, Jack. Ten. Should we do ten or should we do Queen? Well, you can do the Jack. Oh, well. yeah, ten. Jack. Good, good queen, spot. Yeah. Good spot. Um, Should I say what I started doing uh, when we were testing this? Cheating? Is, is, yeah. Just clicking, <laughs> just clicking all the cards that were revealed. <laughs> that's cheating. And it is good at cheating. Stop um, cheating! It's it's. I think I think uh, Richard was calling it um, meta game. It's also not like that, you know. You know, it's it's the game within the game. Far too early. Right. So says oh. the story end says it's far too early for Christmas stuff. Which, um, which it's December. It's not too early. It's never no. uh, uh, November is too early. Too November is definitely too yeah. early. Yeah. I think I think in in the UK we have one fortnight. Yeah. Which is early November. Yeah. But at the moment, Bonfire Night's kind of been sort of overtaken a bit by um, Halloween. So Halloween. Ha Halloween's yeah. getting quite popular. So I've got 49 chocolate coins. Unfortunately, with this game, I do have to be honest, you don't get real chocolate coins. That's the only downside. Hit on sticks. We could have done with a bit of chocolate. I could have done with a bit of chocolate. Yeah. Oh, here you go. So this is the one I was, I was, I was getting. Ah. Uh, so yes. Yeah, so for these ones, coins. there are little twists in this game as you move up. The levels so you've got to collect all the cards with ice to free the padlocks blocking your way so ideally you want to get rid of the ice ones first uh, three oh four it's a good job i can count it does help if you can count on this game <laughs> <laughs> hmm, which i'm struggling with we need the real stuff says check for cat girl we need real chocolate we do need real mm. chocolate yeah ace i've got it i've got it king Oh, do we do the queen? Oh, tells my island. Hi, John. How oh, are you? Hi, John. Hi. Is so two, two. two. It's yeah. gonna have to be the two. It's gonna have to be the two. Because what what it does as well is if you flip the card when there was an option, it, it wiggles the card that you could have picked. Oh, so does it? So it's proper like you'd be like, oh, there's nothing there. Click and it wiggle, and you'd be like, that. damn it! it God damn it! Do it again. Do it again. Wrong. This is such a simple mm. game. I tell you, it's, this is a really nice one um, for the kids. Actually, my kids play this. Oh, Jack! Quit. I always miss the ones covered in ice. Mm. Yeah, this is this, this, and then you have little other ones. Yeah. Right. Oh goodness me. Four, eight. Oh, did you see it? I think it wiggled. Oh, it did. Yeah. It wiggled. So yeah. Nine, <gasps> ten, nine. I was wiggled. I was wiggled at. Nine, ten. Ten, 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 ten. Eight, nine. Ten, 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 ten. ten. No, it's gonna go eight, ten. nine, no. ten. Oh, you can, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. Get rid of that. Eight, yeah. nine, cool. ten, nine, nine. Not possible. Um, oh, uh, two. Uh, Dirk Bish says this would be a great month to feature Frost March. That's a good point. Marketing yeah, really. yeah, it is actually. Mm. Frost March. Good idea. I, I, I use the Frost March art a lot for all the market, all the social media stuff. Yeah, just like going, oh, Frost March. Oh yeah, that's something. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we we'll do Frost Frost March next week. Yeah. Because hopefully, mm. hopefully we might see a bit of Harbinger next week. Yeah. If all goes to plan. That festive game, that. Yeah. Harbinger and Frostbite. Giving you, giving you. Oh, Frostbite, Frost March. Oh, come on. Eight. Close. Seven. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh. End level. 
So you could have lost. So you could, you know, it'll give you points still. Yeah, but it's not. It's not up to my usual yeah. standard. This is what. I, this yeah. Is what, this is what I was doing at lunch. And I was like, <laughs> come on, this is such a simple game. <laughs> so it's not up to right. We'll play one more and then we'll go on to fight Fancy Legends. Yeah. Do you want to put the? Uh, we'll give you the link actually to where the game is on Steam. Yeah, you put me on. Ah. Yeah, the winner will have some Right. Have to wait. Right, I'm on it. Uh, Four. I'll, I'll whiz through this. Draw three, two. Do I do, I do three? Do I do ace? Three, two, three or ace? So twas tw bringing. I can't say his name uh, or her name. Maybe it should be featured in January or February or even Frost March. Oh, we like that. We like that. I'm going three. I'm going three. I'm going two. I'm going ace. Three, I'm going ooh, king. <laughs> Definitely, Dervish says, what better way to celebrate the season, to celebrate the season, than to end the world? I think so. Sometimes I get that feeling. End course. the world? That's what the Harbinger is all oh, about. Oh yes, you're yeah, sorry. Yeah. yeah, I've been writing about the Harbinger today as well, I should know that. Yeah. Nine, oh, ten. You can, you can do that loads. Come on, come on, go on. Nine, eight, nine, seven, nine, eight. Nine, eight. <gasps> nine. Spot choice. Oh. What shall I do? This one. Eight. Eight. Yes. Yeah, yeah, we made eight, eight. seven, eight, nine, ten. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, nine. Woohoo! We're whizzing, we're whizzing. That's good for that. Ten. No, no joke. Stuck, no. stuck. That was a good one, though. Definitely. That was a good one. Even if I do say so myself. Even though Amanda helped me. <laughs> Four. Five. I'm not going to get a wiggle this time. Do you ever play Ursula on like Windows 95? Yeah. I used to play it. I used to play it. Yeah. I, I used to work in my old job. So funny, we had a very senior accountant mm. uh, in, a, in a, at a well known local authority. Mm. And I used to go across and go, oh, I'm not going to say his name. Mm. I need help. Mm. I need help with this. And I'd find him and he'd be sat there in the middle of the day playing solitaire. I was like, you've not got enough work to do. That's what's bad. Day, yeah, can't need an ace. Seven. Seven. Ooh, yes. Do you think I'm gonna do it? Who thinks I'm gonna do it? Can we get rid of Father Christmas? Mm. Come on. Come on, Father Christmas. So we need an ace or a, or a queen. Oh no! Husky. No! Blooming oh no! Men folk. Who just don't get out of the way. Is it gonna do it? Uh, oh, no, come no, no, on. End level, end level. So the story end agrees that the original Microsoft Solitaire was very addictive. It was. So you can play it on um, a browser. I've done that before. Have you? Yeah, yeah. Right, so now, because we've playing. done four levels, we've got chocolate coins, so we can now buy something. So we're going to buy something. Let's oh. start with a Christmas tree. Oh, yeah. I might have been wanting to buy some for that. <laughs> Yeah, so we're going to start with a beautiful Christmas tree. We've put our Christmas tree up back there. Have you? Yeah, yeah. So it's, a, it's, a, it's the first Christmas tree that we've bought. Me and my partner have bought. We've always oh, there it is. There it is. Sorry, I'd lost my Christmas tree. <laughs> right, we're going to buy the Christmas tree with our chocolate coins. Well done. Well done. Well done. So. Lapland solitaire. Lapland ready in no time. Yes. Well, yeah. So not only is this game a great addictive solitaire game, but I like it because I love the graphics. And it's a good way to, you know, busy, not look busy. Yeah. <laughs> it's a great way to count down to Christmas. And it's a great little time filler when you're at work, but you just don't let your boss see or your colleagues. Mm. Probably not a good idea. <laughs> but it's also a brilliant way to um, um, watch what you're eating because you don't get real chocolate coins. <laughs> so I would but never you do you get, does it still do the same, you know, kind of chocolate feeling in your brain? Yeah. You still salivate, going, oh, I've got chocolate <laughs> coins, and then you're like, oh, no, I haven't. <laughs> so that's probably that. Uh, my, so we've, we've got this Christmas tree, and um, my partner's a big fan of putting Christmas chocolate uh, on the Christmas tree. Oh, yeah. And uh, so apparently the thing that he, he and his family used to do is um, they used to eat the chocolate without anybody noticing. Oh, right. And then replace the chocolate in such a way that... Um, you know, the next person who came along was like, oh, that is a piece of chocolate. I will eat it. And then oh, it'll, it'll, it'll only be tinfoil. Oh, so, no. Did they like, fill it with cotton wool? 
That's a good one, actually. That's, that's probably a bit too yeah. sensible, to be honest. Oh, dear. It's a bit like when, you, when you're a teenager and you raid the drinks cupboard and fill the gin up with water. I never did that. Oh, I did. <laughs> Come on, who who's watching? Raided the drinks cabinet, yeah. and topped it up with water. I was sick because because so we had our uh, Christmas do um, earlier on in the week, and you yeah. unfortunately weren't able to make I it. So I, no. I was I was t- telling uh, one of the new guys, Andy, and I was just like, if Bex were here, you'd be on the floor. Oh, she <laughs> <laughs> she could hold her drink, that woman. Oh, what do you mean? <laughs> from Yorkshire. I'm from Yorkshire. You see, uh, fighting fantasy. Uh, yeah. Come Have on, you got the link for Lapland Solitaire? I'm going to put it in there. No, that would be far too sensible. I have not got the scene for. <laughs> we're going to share. We're going to share the link anyway on Lapland, Steam if go. you fancy. Lapland Solitaire. First buying it. It's a great one. Great one to count down to Christmas for those so. of you that think it's not too early for Christmas things. Oh, maybe it could get you into the Christmas spirit. Then I'm not yeah. Yeah. Spirit. Yeah. Because lots of people like buy. You know, listen to Christmas music to make what themselves it? feel festive. Yeah, because it's only 18 days away. I haven't got my Christmas tree up yet. That's land, so the ATM. My spelling of sort of. Yeah. There you go. So we're going to do... Um, oh, brilliant. So there you go. There's the link. Ooh, 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 let me just double check if it's actually up. No, it isn't. Like I say. So and now we're going to play a bit of Fighting Fantasy Legends. So it's not... So yeah, bonus, really, today. Cause we're putting Doubling up, isn't it? Games. Yeah, yeah. It's exciting. So I'm, I'm having to re-add the game capture window. It's a good job Amanda knows what she's doing. Because Gareth sat down and said, Gareth, show me how to set this up. Because every time we set it up, I'm running around getting the kids before I can come on the live stream. And he went, yeah, no problem, Bex. And then by the time we got around to setting it up, he's like, I'm, I'm sorry, I've got too much time, but this is how you do it. I was like, yeah. He's I know exactly what we're doing <laughs> now. <laughs> the, he's, he's done like a Steam 101 set of instructions. Oh, I, know, yeah. I just felt like that. Yeah. That's, pre- that's pretty Fair cool. So, yeah. uh, so this, this game I have been playing and we tested it uh, and it does work across. So I have played this game a bit and um, I have been through the... Which game? Fight Top Mountain. Fight Fantasy, oh, sorry. sorry. Right. Yeah. Jumping, jumping around a bit. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, so I've, I've, I've been through Fighting Fantasy. Okay. Um, Fight Top Mountain. But I've not completed some of the quests. Okay. So uh, I was going to pop through Fire Top Mountain again. Just have a, have a look around. Okay. And then new traps can have a look at the gameplay. Okay. So here we are in Fighting Fantasy Legends. I don't know. Is anyone in the chat not seen this game before? Mm-hmm. I'll ask you that. So, so we've been through City of Thieves, our little, we, we, oh we're an elf. So we can have a look at the quests, so I'll click that button, yeah. the little scroll button there to see what quests we've got. So basically in this game we have, it's sort of a role play game based on the uh, game books by Ian Livingston and Steve Jackson. And the idea of the game is you are a character and you have to wander around the continent of Alancia and complete lots of quests and find lots of gold and defeat lots of enemies. Yeah. Um, and we've got quite an interesting dice mechanic. So, mm. so, so uh, Tor's Bringling and Poseidon, I haven't, I've, ne- neither of them have said it. Seen this ah, one. Yeah. we have a treat for you. Yeah. So it, it's quite, it's, I've, it, it's got a lot more narrative than Talisman has. Which is quite nice. Yeah, it's so much more traditional sort of role play game. Is this yeah, one. definitely. So, mm. uh, so, um, Fight Fantasy Legends follows three of the uh, Choose Your Own Adventure books from yeah. what I remember. And we, uh, oh, I don't remember. So, the City of Thieves, <laughs> yeah. Citadel of Chaos, right, and The Warlock of Fight Top Mountain. Okay. Um, so those are the three books that this game is based on, mm. and. It's not going through the normal books, the, the normal fighting fantasy books, um, because there's slight differences. So in order to complete this game, you've got to work your way through all three books, yeah. and all three books interact with each other. Yeah, it's quite nice. Yeah, and the interesting mechanics with this game is that you can only move forward, which can be extremely frustrating to some people. <laughs> but there is a reason for that, in that it is like the game book, in mm. that when you're reading the book, you can only go forward. See you a bit, John. Hey, so, uh, drop yeah. John, John's nipping off to get some grubs. Okay. Makes, makes food. So I think what we'll do is um, 
we're halfway sort of in the middle of the game because we just thought we'd do a bit of we have streamed this before so for the people that I haven't seen it be have seen it before we thought we'd start a bit in the middle of the game so here we have been through the city of thieves completed quite a few quests so, so, so here's the quest so what, so what I've done so you start the game in the city of thieves which I haven't actually completed so uh, but I have completed warlock of fire top mountain and I've gotten uh, some of the other quests. Yeah, so you've slayed a dragon. So slayed a dragon. So dragon slayer. Yeah, visited the village of Anvil. Yeah. Found yes, yes, Tromo. If that's how you pronounce it. You found a silver throne now. Oh no, you haven't found a silver throne now. Yeah, so that's that's part of uh, the okay. city of thieves. There you go. Yeah. So it's there. That's handy. And you've whoever got that is very smart. The <laughs> city of thieves. Yeah. So city of thieves there. So Anvil would be would have been part yeah. of the uh, Warlock of Fire Top Mountain. But, so, but this one is part of the War of Fight of Mountain mm. um, story. Yeah. So we're about to go and venture in back into Fight of Mountain. Should we try and complete the quests. Try like, and, the quests. and what have we got in our inventory? What monsters have we slain? We can say what inventory. Inventory. These are the creatures that we've slain so far. A dragon. And the idea in this game is to try and slay every creature. So you uh, complete your creature codex. So we're just forty percent. Complete, yeah. which is quite difficult to do actually. Uh, I have not 100% done No, <laughs> I haven't either. Uh, um, I think I've Michael spent has been a lot of time. Yeah, okay. But, but he tested it, so that one's quite entertaining. Yeah, the wheelie. The wheelie. Doing this so let's, let's go, let's go. So it's a bit like you know, you only have limited options as to where you go. I'm playing it, am I? Oh, yeah, you can do. Right, we're all going to go over to see the mountain. Now, this is a very dangerous mountain, so there is Firetop Mountain. The fire top mountain stands before you, covered in strange red vegetation. Is that not cold lava? <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking that. I was just thinking that. Right, well, I suppose, I suppose vegetation would be cold, lava would be hot. Yeah. Maybe. So okay. Who knows? Yeah. So now we've entered fire top mountain, and we have two options. We can go right into this mysterious door, or we can go left. But there's an orc. Sleeping Ooh, in the there's a ghoul walk the there. Mindful so, alert. what do you reckon? Right or left? Door. We'll go to the right, through the, the door. See what's in here. So, the passageway ends at a sturdy wooden door. You may attempt to charge the door down or head west. Uh, try the door? We'll charge it. Barge it. Charge it. Charge the door. Right. Oh, so I've got some items. So what happens here is we're going to charge the door, so we've got to use our strength. So the red dice are our strength. And you'll see on some of the dice there are fists. Some of the dice have three fists, and that means we have powered up during the game so far to get an extra fist on that dice. So when we roll, if we get a fist, that is like a point. Some of the dice are still empty. As you can see, I've only got one fist on, on there. And um, the aim of the game really is to build up your strength so the most the stronger you are, the more likely you are to roll a fist yeah. and defeat. Objects. So fists are successes, yeah. blanks are not successes, and the red dice are the skill dice, and the green dice are the luck dice. And the green dice are the luck for luck ones. Yeah. So this one's so a skill test. We so have you can, some potions here. So you can either uh, roll the dice because the target score is two. Yeah. So, but because quite a lot, a lot of my dice have fists on, you're in with a bit with a good yeah. good shout of doing two, so you can save your items. But it's, if it was quite a difficult one, you'd use an item to, uh, there you go, drink this to pass one skill test. So, yeah. you, so it's up to you, Ray. Would you, do you want to use don't. the item? I think we've got a good chance of rolling two here, haven't we? So go we're yeah, going to go for it. it. And we'll if work. you click and hold it, they shake. <laughs> <laughs> Shaky dice. Shaky dice. Out as a fan. Out as a fan. Okay. So, so we've got three. three. We so need a target yeah. soft too. So we've passed. We have barged the door down and not lost any health points. Ooh. Uh-oh. A giant uh -oh. spider draws in from darkness to attack. You must roll one less skill dice for this combat. So we've now got to fight the spider. And he's worth a value of eight. So we've got to roll an eight in order to defeat him. And we're going to keep rolling until we've got picked him off. So we take it in turns to roll. So we roll first. Mm -hmm. Oh, we've got a sword. Sword and a shield. And well. a shield. So shield. Ah! You got a three. If you if you uh, get a success on the shield, it protects you from one of your monster attacks. Yes. So, yeah. so we've got some 
Yeah. Good dice we'll in there. Right. Oh, we're going to be all right. We'll have him. He did bite me, though. I've lost three health. Ah, oh, easy. Easy, easy. Seregniff. Hi, Seregniff. Hi. Hello. We are streaming uh, Fighting Fantasy today. Slightly different. We've just cautiously approached a goblin-like creature. Mm. All right, then. So now we're going to try and tiptoe past him and hope we don't wake him. So this is the lock dice. I have not... Um, upgraded the lot dice as much as I have upgraded the skill dice. So if if, if you fail, I'm just writing. <laughs> Can you use that any time? Because you, I think it's got two uses. So this uh, this okay. one has only got two uses. Well, so I I would roll, and if you lose, <gasps> he just wakes up and you fight him. But since I'm totally overpowered, yeah, you'll just beat him up. <laughs> okay. Uh oh. You crunch on some loose ground and he wakes up. We're attacked. We're attacked. We've got to fight the orc. Come on, come on. Two. There he goes. Yeah. Oh, he's only he's only got a strength of five. He's a weakling. He's a weakling orc. Poor spider. Oh, no, uh, spiders deserve everything they come towards them. Well, they do. Particularly ones that big. <laughs> <laughs> right then, where are we going? Should we go another door? Should we go straight on? Uh, that's not true. Uh, well, question. I suppose I suppose the quest. So, so there's two quests I haven't completed. One is find Eric. Right. The other one is, and you need to find three keys to open. At the there's a chest um, that was Zagor's chest. Okay. So you need to find three keys. I'm, I can't remember how many keys I have. Well, if we're trying to find someone, maybe we should go through a few doors. Uh, so that's one key. That's two keys. So we need a third uh, key. Okay. So we need a third. We need to find a third bronze key. Okay. We need to put the link for this game as well. We should put the link in the chat. Oh, I missed that door. Uh, I'm going to miss a couple of doors out because what? if you get the game, yeah. you can do a bit of exploring yourself. I'll go in this one. Ooh, this is interesting. We're going to have a game of chess. Oh! An old, an old chest. chest. What's in the chest? You yeah. opened the chest? Sorry, go on. Uh, no, sorry. Or, or, we can, or we can, you know, sound more mystical and do it at the same time. Uh, you opened the chest. <laughs> Finding some, some gold pieces. some gold pieces. Roll six <laughs> of your luck dice and gain one gold for each. Oh success. yes! So we're gonna get some gold. Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight. We need more gold. Two. You can never have too many gold. No. Does that make it a nice round? No, it doesn't. See, this has got gold coins in as well, and these aren't chocolate either. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh, true. That's very true. <laughs> right. Is that it? That's it for oh. that room. Yes. Yeah. We're indeed, off. indeed. We're oh. off. Thank you, the story ends. He's linked to Fighting Fantasy Dungeons. Oh, Very thank nice you. <laughs> thank you, that Got saves Manda. Got as always. Saves Manda did it. Right, where should we go? Should we look in a door or should we walk along the corridor? Have a door. Let's have a look in the door. You need to find me a bronze key. A bronze key. We've got to find a bronze, bronze key. Bronze key, I need to find Eric. You spot something interesting on the ground. Ooh, got a tome. Find an old book which describes training techniques. Plus five HP. FP. Oh, brilliant. So your XP is this purple bar along here mm -hmm. and once your xp gets up mm -hmm. to the top yep. once it's full you can then choose to power up get a fist on one of your skill dice or get a four leaf clover on one of your luck dice mm -hmm. now it's quite easy to power up at the beginning of the game but as you progress through the game you have to get a lot more points so i'm not going to go in every door oh. hello nathron I think that's how you pronounce your name. Um, you've got blue te text on a black background, so I'm just like that. What? We've got. Uh, oh, it's really it. difficult, isn't it? Oh. Stregniff. Oh. We'll try this door. Let's have a look. You spot something interesting on the oh, ground. Oh, could it be a key? Heart. <gasps> when I wouldn't. Use say. when fighting a vampire. Plus a luck test to throw the stake at its heart. Brilliant. That's that's handy. If you come against a vampire. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to miss that door. I'm going to go through here. I'm going to pull the left lever. Right. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Go fast. Oh, sorry. Re reading me text. Sorry. <laughs> Narrator's like, Manda. what, what, what? Click in, stop it. Manda will read it from memory. <laughs> oh, my goodness me. The port calls opens. There Yay. Come on, we're going. <laughs> now then, I'm going to go left or right. Left or right. Left looks more mysterious. Left. We can Let's go left. Right I'm quite conscious to do this 
Because you know exactly where you're going. I know exactly where I'm going. I know roughly where I'm going because I've not played it for a bit. Oh, haven't you? So, so. I and this I, game I, a lot. Have, I have a poor memory, which I think makes me a very forgiving person. Let's look for a key. Let's look for a key in here. Checking for a secret package passage, you push the wall, hear a click, feel dizzy, and slip to the ground. Oh. Lose two stamina. Oh, and that wasn't good. Oh, I'll tell you what. Oh. oh. Some ginger beer. Thank you very much. Some ginger beer. I have to have ginger beer when we stream me and my dad. <laughs> right, that was no good, was it? Okay. This is actually one of my favourite of Nomad's oh. games. Cheers. Cheers. I, I love this game. I got quite addicted to it. Oh, thank you very much. All I can that. say, it's a good job working for Nomad that playing games. <laughs> Is research. Yeah, <laughs> you can get away with it. You, you're talking about your work colleague, and you're like, "God damn it, playing solitaire." Yeah. but I'm playing solitaire. I'm like, "No, it's work." Yeah, it's, it's work. work. It's work. The oh, passageway but... comes to a dead end. You suddenly hear a deep, resonating laugh all around you. <laughs> <laughs> you have no choice but to return the way you came. That was a good part. Okay, I enjoyed the deep, resonating laugh. Did you like it? That was good. Right. Okay, we're gonna go this way. Here we go. Ooh, we found a room. Oh, is it a room? Uh oh. You hear a crumbling beneath your feet and try to leap back as the ground gives way. Test your luck. Target score two. Mm. So come on, dice. It might. It might be worth using your thing. Oh. Uh, because you always fall down, don't you? Sorry. I'm rushing ahead. I'm rushing ahead. I was unlucky. Strategic. <laughs> You've oh. unlocked the title. Unlucky. I'm unlucky. Well, what you can do is, is uh, so press OK. Uh, you are too slow and fall two metres down into the a pit. Ah, two stamina. Really? Sound effects. Ah! Uh-oh. So you can change your name if you want. So currently called Ariel the Unlucky, but if you click that, ta -da, we can go back oh. to Ariel the Dragon Slayer, which is, which I think. Do you think? I like cheese thrower. <laughs> I'm going to be cheese thrower. Yeah, Ariel the cheese thrower. Yeah. <laughs> there are quite a lot of things you need to do with cheese. You in this wonder game. you wonder what you had to do to get yeah. that name, isn't it? We spot something out the corner. Uh oh gosh. Oh, rope trap. Coil of rope is not nice. Yeah. You find a coil of rope. You pick it up <sighs> and it rope. attempts to wrap itself around your neck. Test your luck. Ugh. Uh Keep we trying until you shake it off. Lose two stamina for each failure. Yeah, I'll probably use the. Is it a one? Do we only have to get one then? Yeah. It'll be alright with one, won't we? So try it. Oh, it's up to you. Because that rope trap's a pain in the bob. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try it. Come on. Go for it. We only need one. Yay! Excellent, excellent. Yeah, we only excellent. need one. Sometimes um, you need like two or three with the rope, don't yeah, you? Yeah, the rope trap is really, really brutal. The rope trap sometimes we had to brutal. We had to tweak that whilst we were testing. Because originally it was a, a, like a three, um, a successful of three for the rope trap. Yeah. And you were there forever. You're like, oh my yeah. days, come on, let's <laughs> give it. Just died yeah, every just time. Every time you got the rope trap, you just died. Yeah. Because you can also play this game on like, so I think I've got this on like easy. Play all games on easy. But yeah. I've got it on easy and there's like difficult, there's like legendary mode where, yeah. where the rope trap um, to success grows up to three again. Right, okay. So there's something, something to bear in mind. I've only played. Play it on yeah. I only play games on easy. I played easy. Less. I have less. I have no shame. Ooh, monsters. You enter a large cavern and see an oversized human, at least three meters tall. The giant spots you and roaring loudly, he throws a for a pitchfork at you like a spear. Ah, that's not very friendly. <laughs> oh, chest. Oh, look, score three. No, should we try the look thing on this? Oh, that's my healing potion. Yeah, Just a look. yeah, go for it. It's three. Yeah, that's quite hard. We'll use it. Because that pitchfork might be a bit painful. Yeah. I the pitchfork think. misses you. The giant picks up a shovel and prepares to attack you with it. Uh, uh, what? Ooh, let's see what people are saying. I've still got to fight him. Hello, Kikias. <sighs> right, come on oh, then. Game, 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 gamer sin tempo. Hello, oh. gamer sin tempo. How are you? Gamers in Tempo says, fantastic game. I made a series of videos in my channel. A shame it's not in Spanish. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. I'm sure that in mind. Sorry, my dear. Yeah, sorry. T turn my phone off, it keeps bleeping. Oh, winner. Yes. We have killed the giant. 
Sorry. Sorry, giant. You search the giant's huge purse and find eight gold pieces. Fantastic. Thank Do you think it'd be human sized gold pieces or giant sized gold pieces? Well, I would hope it would be giant sized, but how would he fit it in? Is it in her bag? How would Ariel fit it in her bag? Magic. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> she could be. Well, she, she elf, com, elf com mermaided Ariel. <laughs> Huh? Elf come mermaid. Ariel. Mermaid, mermaid come elf. Yeah. Yes. Because sure. yeah, Ariel is the mermaid. Oh, we've come to the river. Schnee. Hello, Schnee. And we must cross Hi. the river. You're all right. Uh oh. I hope I pronounced your name right. <laughs> we have been swept downstream to into a uh, to a large cavern with banks on both sides. The current washes you to the thing. <gasps> and here we are. Uh, there. Are, uh, there appear to be two ways of crossing the river. A rusty bell uh, bears a sign, ferry service, two gold pieces, please ring bell. A rickety old bridge crosses the river, which uh, you could attempt to walk across. So ring the bell or cross the bridge. I think we've just got a load of gold, haven't we? Shall we ring the bell? Go for it. I'm going to turn my phone off because it won't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. Ye gods, my spelling. Right. Okay. What happened then? Didn't we not ring the bell? Uh, we did ring the bell. Maybe, because it could be. Uh, the bellman's not there. Oh, the, bell. <laughs> the bellman's gone. Where is the bellman? That's, that's the advantage of, uh, you know, um, what they call it again? Video games, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> if, you were, if you were reading a book, the bellman would always be there. If you're playing a game, the bellman ain't always there. <laughs> No. Sometimes the bellman goes goes for a cigarette around the back. You yeah. don't know. Bellman. It's Christmas. It should be 100% <laughs> on duty. Ooh, the rotting and decayed timbers of the bridge snap under your feet. You must react quickly to regain your footing or fall into the river below. Right, quick. Ah, ah. Test your skill. Quick, quick. So we should get this, hopefully. Oh, yes. There we go. We've got quite a three. Here. We only needed three then. So we've got three. Ooh, we've nearly got our oh. XP as well. Oh, we have. Good. We've done it. We've got a dice upgrade. Upgrade me luck because it's poor. Right, we're going to upgrade luck because it's not good. <laughs> you see, when I play this game, I play a different tactic. Mm. Every time I upgrade my skill. I do, I do that a yeah. lot. Yeah. But we do it, it does luck. seem. It, it, um, Ooh, there we go. Another it it does seem the way forward. Okay, it falls into the river, but we managed to keep our balance and cross the bridge. That was very lucky. It's very dangerous game, this, so it's yeah. not for the faint-hearted. Uh, the story ends, as just said, said as much. Uh, anything that could go wrong does go wrong in the game to your character. It's very true. Yeah, they're, they're, um, yeah it's it's quick when you're going around uh, the Port Black Sands. It's proper like, you know, and then this person tries to kill you, and then this person tries to kill you, and then this person tries to kill you. And then a few folk who you meet who don't try to kill you, you can kill them. Mm. Whoever wrote mm. this has no moral gauge, no moral compass. <laughs> you just kill anyone, yeah. even sort of little old men and yes. children. <laughs> I've yes. killed children in my time in this game. God. Oh, we got some well, more they're, gold. They're not, they're not strictly speaking children, though, are they? They're no. just like goblins, small goblins. Yeah. Cool. Anyway. Oh, there we go. You hear a fluttering of wings and look up to see giant bats <gasps> swooping bats. down to attack you. Ah! Bats, do you know, I like bats as well. I don't want to kill them. Right, come on, let's kill these dice. Now, we haven't got any sound on for the game. There should be some sound on. Um, is there sound on? I hope there's sound on. Can you on. hear the music from the game? Please let us know. Oh, I suppose we should be um, um, doing a giveaway. Oh yeah, for Lapland Solitaire. Yeah. So, um, if you would like to be put into the hat for a Lapland Solitaire case, uh, please leave a comment uh, in the chat. You know, if you if you just uh, sit in there, all you need to do is just like you know, I am here, enter, and then your name will get put into the hat. Well, uh, I love Lapland. I love Christmas. I can't be. <coughs> yes. <coughs> yeah, yeah. I love, I love Christmas. Yeah. Give me baubles or give me blood. Yeah. So that could be the YouTube one, couldn't yes. it? Yes. Give me baubles. Or give me blood. Give me baubles. So if you're watching on YouTube, we'll draw the YouTube one next week. So type in the YouTube chat. Give me baubles. Give me baubles. But Drop. keep it quite deep. Give me baubles. Yeah. I suppose.
suppose, how would you spell ball balls? That is my next question. I have no idea how you spell ball balls. Ball balls. Ball balls. <laughs> that's, that's, bear balls. that's how you say it. <laughs> ball balls, bear balls. <laughs> Frugal had steak. Can I have, can I have Oh, yeah, hands? sorry. Thank you. I don't know how to spell ball balls. Um, oh, whilst Manda's looking how to spell ball balls, should we ball go balls. right into the cave or oh. carry on straight on? Let me know in the chat. Ball balls. Yeah, go right or straight on? Balls. So, so, oh, See hello. The pitchfork. Oh, here we go. Oh, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Hi, so, guys. So, on YouTube. Uh, oh, uh, Antigram. Hi. Nicholas Villet and uh, Darius M. So, hi. Hi, guys. Hi. How are you? Thanks for joining us. So, so our, our phrase for next week's uh, YouTube prize draw is. What do we say? I can't remember. <laughs> That's why I was going for a gap. Give like, me baubles. Was it was. I think it was give me baubles. Give me yeah. baubles. Oh, oh, Uncle Uncle Elmas has got our back. <laughs> yeah. Game sounds low, but fine for me. Oh, okay. All right, baubles. Baubles. Give me baubles. Oh, so yes, give me. Oh baubles. right, right. We're going right. Thanks, guys. We're give going right. Me baubles. Give me mouths. Give me the mouths. Right, so, we're going right. So don't 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 leave a comment now. Uh, leave a comment uh, when when the video has been archived, and then you'll be put into the bar draw for next week. Yeah. So that's so that's give me baubles. Give me baubles. Correctly. Uh, who told me to go right? Fritchie. Fritchie and oh, and Dirt Dirt Fish. Fish. Yeah. Um, uh, there's a zombie, zombie there. Shuffles towards ah, you. Fight. We've got to fight the zombie now. Um, fight. A gruesome looking zombie. Okay, come on, we need a five. We've got three, four. Oh, that's oh. five. Oh, was it five? No oh, way. Yes, we have the sword. Yes, the yeah, zombie good defeated. Time. That was a hardcore zombie needing five stabs. Normally you just stab him in the head, it's just one. It's hardcore this Maybe game. it's a different type of zombie. Yeah. Do you get different types of zombies? You do actually. I mean, if, 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 if you go into movies and if you take account of all the movies ever, you yeah. have the, uh, you know, like the John Romero, like the original zombies. They're they're sort of considered slow moving zombies. You then have the twenty eight day later zombies, which are fast running zombies. Okay. Uh, I, and I, I don't quite know the rest, but those are the two I do know. And then you have like the Walking Dead zombies, but I don't think they really run fast. They don't run fast. But they they kind of go in. Uh, they've got that swarm mentality yeah. about them. The, the they're Walking a bit Dead stupid zombies. as well. Right, so from the other side of this door, we can hear cursing, laughing, and joking. Ooh. It sounds like there are several creatures inside the room. Would you like to open the door? Yeah. Shall we? Sounds like they're having a lark. Should we open the door and join the party? They can't be having as much fun with us. They have got ginger beer. <laughs> it's that kind of game, I guess, isn't it? You know? I, I keep lashing me ginger beer. It does. I keep meaning to um, contact. Old uh, old Jamaica <laughs> yeah. and ask them for some commission because <laughs> we do a lot of advertising for ginger beers, don't we? Very too yeah. Oh no! Right, we've got. We're gonna ask ask you all what we should do. There you go. Sitting in this room around a wooden table are four dwarves with long bushy beards. They are cursing, laughing, and joking as they play dice uh, as they play a dice game. As you walk in, their merriment stops. They are on guard and don't appear to be too dangerous. Do you ask for directions, attack them, or join in? Go on, tell us. Ask for directions, attack, or join in. What should we do, guys? They are having a bit of merriment, and they've probably just got that local pub mentality where they're just kind of like, who is that stranger? Yeah, they're like, don't spoil our fun. But once you kind of, you know, bottle them up. Yeah, if we tell them we've got ginger beer, why is that not an option? <laughs> tell them we've got ginger beer. Complain to the developers, guys. Yeah. Complain. So what should we do, guys? Let us know. Join in, attack, or ask for directions. Free drinks. So the story ends. Says join in. Oh, Dirtbitch says ask for directions. Oh. Anyone else? Anyone else? Join in, ask for directions, attack. Give them baubles. <laughs> yeah. Uh, ask the obnoxious tourists. Okay. <laughs> I think that's ask for directions, isn't it? Oh, so I think. What's that what we're doing? What's more with feeling? What's more with feeling? Don't forget if you're on YouTube, make a comment. Oh, not now. It'll be at the end. Uh, can't so they ever they make it now? Yeah. Can't they? It wouldn't get added in. Oh, it wouldn't. It? I'm so sorry. it's for sorry. So Do it at like, the end. Ignore that. But you can you can get put into a draw now if you make a comment on Twitch 
And if you yeah. make a comment on Twitch, you'll get uh, uh, entered into the prize draw, which we'll probably draw in uh, about five te- five minutes. Yeah, we'll probably do a couple of those throughout the stream. Yes. Because we're generous. If we remember. <laughs> <laughs> we will remember. Oh, I think the consensus is join in. Join in. So join in. Mm-hmm. We'll, jo- we'll join in with dwarves, and you guys join in to win some keys. Yeah. Some Hesit- inter- hesitantly, but they let you join with their game. I'm going to cheat. I'll you, play fair. You chat oh. with them quite harmlessly. They are playing dwarf dice. You may play fair or cheat. Ooh, what so, shall we do? When they come for you, bad boy. <laughs> <laughs> cheat, play fair. Cheat, play cheat, fair. Cheat, play fair, fair. Well, I was accused of cheating with Black Man Solid Hair, so I say cheat. Cheat, yep. Yeah. Uh, we're Cheshire Cat Girl says cheat. <laughs> Come on then, let's cheat. We shall carry on as we started. So we're going to test our luck score. Do we want to do a oh, potion? Oh, oh, that's, that's healing. healing. That's so healing I've got, potion. So I've got no more of the... Oh yes! We got a three! I speak that. Good call, Cheshire Cat Girl. They do not spot your cheating. <laughs> Roll six luck dice and again a gold piece for each success. <laughs> Fantastic. Good job we graded our luck dice. A smart Indeed. move. Indeed. Smart Indeed. move, Manda. Oh, one gold. <laughs> oh, we're rich. Okay, I'll let you read that. You chat about various things and they seem friendly enough. They tell you that you are currently in the maze of Zargo. Ooh. and Is that, that not Zagor? Zagor, probably. And and that they are t- there are two ways to leave. The easiest is to leave the room, turn left, then follow the tunnel. Then they say if you want to go deeper into the maze, you need to leave the room, then turn right, turn left, turn right, turn left, straight on. And then they start getting a bit vague. You thank them and leave the room. Mm. So so if you want to leave, we need to come out and go left. But if you want to go into the dungeon, you go right. <coughs> what should we do? Hang on. <laughs> so, so, so left is that way. And so left, left, right. Oh, we're no, mirror image. Yeah, because yeah, so, that's your left, isn't it? Yeah. So if we're looking like that. So it's left? Yes. And then right. Or right. So right is further into the map. So further into the map. Go on then, what I do you say? say? Anyone? Anyone? First person to answer in the chat. Left or right, we'll go that way. So. Yeah. Did you do that when you were driving? Left or right? Yes, just me. Oh, right. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Never did that. Mm. F. Or, or, or you're one of these few people that are gifted with the knowledge of knowing which one's your left one and which one's your right one, and you're not like that going. I swear this one's not the right one. We're going right. Oh, we've got one right and two lefts. Right, because just can't go left. Oh uh, yeah, we did say first person. Yeah. We're going right. Go to the <gasps> character's white, which is your. They left. tricked us. <laughs> Those dwarfs. <laughs> it's a dead end. The passageway comes to a dead end. Ah. You hear a deep laugh. <laughs> Well, that was just tricksters. And we're telling her. Well, maybe well, we, you were cheated. We could probably, you know, go. go blah, 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 blah. We could, probably could have had gone back in and shown them what for. Oh, could we? Yeah, because there was an option to attack, wasn't there? Uh, yeah, we could have done. That was a bit mean. But yeah. you can go back. Should we go and attack yeah, them? Yeah, go on, go on. Alright, Manda's telling me to attack them. You should have given us wrong directions. <sighs> you wouldn't want to. You wouldn't want to cross <laughs> this lady, I did not tell you. Go, 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 go. Right, we're going to attack. You gave us wrong directions. We're going to attack them. What do I look like? Some ah, sort of melon. Fight. Fight. We're going to fight them by giving us the wrong directions. You pesky dwarves. How dare you. Oh, yeah. And I've got a healing potion. Oh, they'd, yeah. They'd be Take that. Dwarves. Take that, dwarves. How many, how many are there? One of you. <coughs> Four, I said. Four. Four. <coughs> Four. <laughs> What have you got me into, Manda? <laughs> I'm not All into right. fighting. Right. Oh, come on, dwarves. We'll kill. Actually, this will be good for our XP. Get yeah. our XP up. Yes, indeed. Not good for the dwarves, mind. Here we go. Kill. And there fight go. again. Fight. Might have to use a healing potion a bit. Fight. This Ooh, right. Fight. Straight off. Yeah. Straight. Wow. Fight. Fight. I hope this. we get some booty after doing all this. <laughs> I've got one. Come on, cheese thrower. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Oh. oh, four gold pieces. Is that it? <laughs> okay. Yeah. We killed yeah. them. So Girl. if they were going to be of any use, they're not anymore. <laughs> Death men tell no tale. Yeah. Here we go. So now we're back where we were. Right, where should we go? Go straight on? Ah, another 
a dead end. This is like a maze. And it can be very frustrating, I can tell you. When you have a quest to fulfil. Yes, because we've got to find us some keys. Yeah, let's have a look in here. Some bronze keys. Ooh, a bed. We can have a little rest. You look around and find nothing of interest. Nothing of interest? <laughs> There's a bed. We can have a sleep. It's, 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 it's uh, not got any... I always thought like they look like bits of rope, interest. but upon closer inspection, I think that's a bunker, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Right. Personally, I I would have had a little sleep. <laughs> uh, yeah. Where are we going? Where are we going? Ooh, quite a lot of options. Yeah. Let's go down. Good. Down. Well, that was clearly a dead end, isn't it? Clearly. <laughs> oh no! Another dead end. Oh dear. Another dead end. And we've played this before. All right. I think that's the way we came. So I think we need to go, go up, up and then left. Let's go left. Let's go left. Oh, all right. So this game is on PC, Mac, iOS, and Android. Ooh, ooh, so before what? we move, I think we should do a prize draw. Right, draw six o'clock, prize there. draw. And while we're doing the prize draw, which way do you guys want to go? Down, left, right? So whilst I figure out how to Possibly not right, because we'll just come from there, I think. Draw. Make sure. So, so we're going right. to go right, so really? Should we put John in? Leave John in, take John out. All right, so I'm going to have Stop a roll. I tell him we're cheating. There we go. So here we go. So Dirtbish, Dirtbish, you have won a prize of uh, Latland Tell Latland Tell Well done. Get you in the festive spirits. Well done. Eat all the blooming Christmas pudding. Up, no, wait, down. <laughs> yeah, up, down, left, right. <laughs> ah, which way? This is okay. Everybody's, everybody's just like that. No, which direction? Which we don't care. Oh. We don't care about Latland Tell That's no. the thing in the back. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> we need to go! Alright, so. so Derbish, what did you win? You won a copy of Lapland Solitaire. The, the game we streamed earlier. So, hours of fun. Hours of fun. Where are we going? So, uh, I don't I know. I need to pull a, st a key off the system then, don't yes, I? Yes, yes, do you know where they are? Yeah. Alright, cool. You cool. carry on. You carry on playing. So, 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 which way are we going? But yes, thank you very much. Hope you enjoy uh, Lapland Solitaire. It's a good way to, good way to waste. Shall I email you with that? Uh, if you got your email there, how am I going to send it to you? Uh, you well, if it's on FSO one if it's on the network, then I can get it. Ian Gareth's account? Yeah, uh, yes. Oh yeah, you can then. Yeah, I'll show you. If it's on the tip network, or tip network. In the meantime, what is the consensus? Left, right, forward. This is where I'm like, you know, if it's public, re reading, go back. reading out my password as I type it in. Yeah, <laughs> go back. Right. Ah, there we go. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, there. Yep. There. Uh, and then scroll there. There, there, there. There. Oh, no, we're not doing that one. No. Sorry. Wrong game. Wrong game. There. Oh, that's we're having oh, 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 wrong, wrong game. Press the wrong one. Lapland Solitaire. Lapland Solitaire. Here we go. So we can probably end that up. Yeah. Okay. So here we go. And we'll do another raffle. We'll do another raffle. Yeah. As we go along. So I think you could. Whoops, I didn't do That's not what I meant to do. Can't. Can't work this thing. Here we go. Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. So we're not going up. Thank you. Right, Thank you from Uncle Elias. We're not going up. I think that's a good move. Don't go up. Don't think we'll get anywhere. Right, we're gonna go. Where are we going? Left. Here we go. So, so Left. where is Dirtbish? Go the other right. Says Junk Farmer. Go the other right. Left. Here we go. Uh, up. No, wait. Down. Left. Uh, here we go. <laughs> it's really not helpful. Left. So I think we're going left. Yeah. So is it left? Left on the game. Is it left? As you look at it. Left. This is your left hand. Yes. Yeah, so, 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 so the Le so, so is it is it left <laughs> left to the player? So wouldn't that mean that way? No, it's left to us. We're looking at. All oh, right. See, that that is something we <laughs> have to clarify. Is it left to us or is it left to the player? So, I don't know. So you think it's left to us? So. Oh, that's a good question. Left to Ariel. Is it left on the screen or is it left to the player? Because oh. if it's left the way we're facing, then it's that way, isn't it? All right, go left. So, down. So is it down, down? Down. Down then, okay. I hadn't thought of that. Left to the player. Oh, junk farmer. So left left to the direction the character is pointing. Okay. So if the character's if the character's pointing that way, left is that way. Yeah. So if the character's pointing oh, that way, left is that way. Who knew such a game could be so The character's pointing that way, left is that way. 
Right, okay. Okay. Right. Have a sit down. Uh, should we go in this door? Let's yeah. have a look. Let's explore. We haven't done much exploring. Yes, Ooh. Keys. Keys. In this room is a grey haired old man sitting at a desk. He is surrounded by books. Thousands of them line the shelves around the walls from the floor to the ceiling. As you enter, he looks up at you. <sighs> what do you want? The old man gives you an icy glare, seemingly irritated by the disturbance. You may apologise, explaining that you lost your way and leave by the south or west door, or try to talk to the man. Well, we, we need to find some keys, don't we? We better talk to him then, haven't we? We're trying, the keys, and we're trying to find Eric as well. He may either be pleasant or demands that he answers your questions. Ooh, that's a good question, because I, 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 I know the answer to this one. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't. I always failed at this one. I've never, and I can't remember what I did. Yes. I'd always say be pleasant, but as I've always failed with it, I probably need to demand some answers. Yes. Go for it. Give it a go. He shrieks ah! and hides behind his desk. <laughs> he uh, is terrified by your aggressive manner. He explains that he is the maze master in charge of the maze of Zagor. Zagor. <laughs> you talk to him and reassure him that you mean him no harm and he comes out of from behind his desk uh, do you know I've never done this <laughs> he sits down and points to a book which floats through the air and lands Ooh. on the desk in front of him he must be a wizard of some power you ask him the way out of the maze he tells you to leave through the south door continue until you come to a crossroad and then turn left alright so we need to remember this guys ok so south door leave through the south way. door Continue until you come to the crossroads and then turn left. left. Okay. So what okay. did he give us? Oh, he just gave us direction. Oh, is that mm -hmm. it? Mm -hmm. I thought we'd gained some mystical book mm -hmm. from that lovely library. So out and then left. So the player's left, our right. Right. And then keep going until you hit the crossroad. So crossroad. Say this is the crossroad. Yeah. So I say that left. Least. Left. Okay. Oh, where are we going? Ooh! You see a great <gasps> orc standing over two okay. metres tall. Sorry. Okay. Oh, yeah, there's a difference between orc and ogre, isn't there? My bad. Yeah, generally the spelling. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's that too. There. He attacks you with a large wooden club. Ah! You should give him what for? We should get props for this game next time we play it. <gasps> get props and dress oh, up. Clubs and swords and yeah. zombies. Oh, we could have got the zombie lord from Smash Up in here. We could have been <laughs> zombieing away. He'd love this game with some fellow zombies. Oh, well, that's true, true. Yeah. Get, get a, a nice, a nice, um, a nice car game that you can just sit and click away. Yeah. And like, oh. I wonder if he'd like Flatman Solitaire. <laughs> Definitely. I'd be back scared by all the cute snowmen. Here we go. As you enter the blah 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 blah, blah <laughs> Zagor's, I can't say that room. As you enter Zagor's room, you think back on the epic battle that took place here. Zagor was a powerful adversary, and Alantia is safer place with him gone. Because I've obviously killed him. Uh, yes. Yeah. Because I mean, if you look at my feet. Junk farmer, he, you want props, don't you? Yeah. Props would be awesome. Because yeah. I, I have seen, I have seen something that I'm tempted to buy, and it's like a, a, a live action role playing cape. Oh, okay. <laughs> that you can just wear like day to day, just you know, like a you know, like a Lord of the Rings, where yeah. you have like a, a cape with a hat and then the, the little badge. So cape and the hat, and then one day, Rex, I'll come in with my cape, and you'd be like, Manda, is that the cape, the RPG cape? And I'll be like, Yes, yes, it is. I finally bought it. Uh, oh, you got it on your Christmas list. Yes, from Santa. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Mm. Here we go. Uh, this story door has no handle or keyhole. Oh. It emits a low hum. Suggesting it could be locked by magical means. Uh, perhaps the warlock used a magic spell to keep intruders out. There must be something important on the other side. The only way to open the door is by, but is by force, so you charge it as hard as you can. Lose five seconds. Uh, <laughs> no, we've only got ten left. Ah, here we go. Sat on a low table against the wall uh, in this room is a large test, which you decide to investigate. So this is the chest I've been trying to open. Ah, from, okay. From all around, yet from nowhere, a mysterious uh, sound fills the room. It sounds like uh, rumbling thunder. <sighs> you notice the chest uh, is held shut by three locks. And the noise gets louder. Ah. It's 
So, so I can either smash open the chest or use my bronze keys, but I've only got two bronze keys. So do you want to smash open the chest? Let's smash it open, because I think today's theme is just be brutal. <laughs> As you start to hack away at the chest, the loud rumbling gets louder. A loud crack deafens you, and uh, from one corner, a lightning bolt shoots towards you. Ah. There we go. So, oh no. One, what did we need? Four. Four. Oh, that's harsh. Oh. That is harsh. Lightning bolt sends you reeling across the room. Ah. Then Killed everything us. fades to black. We're dead. And you've cursed my dice. Oh. Well, the beauty about this game, for those that have not seen it before, is you don't actually die. So, you don't go all the way back to the beginning. Just you get a curse get, on like, your dice. Get booted out of the area, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you get booted out of Five Top Mountain. Here we go. Oh, I, I, I like and some of these. your dice have crosses on, and if you roll a cross, you just automatically die. Uh, fail. That's yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you regain consciousness, looking up at the blue sky. Oh. The previous foul smell replaced with fresh air. You're not entirely sure how you got here, but we feel revealed to be alive. Feeling somewhat battered and bruised, you dust yourself down and rest for a while at the foot of the mountain. There you go. And they get the cursed dice uh, that you were explaining. Has anyone in the chat played this game? Oh, here we go. So yeah, before. I saw this. Uh, anyone played this game hmm, before? Should we switch to the cardinal directions? What's that? Cardinal? Cardinal? Is that how you pronounce it? C-A-R-D-I-N-A-L. Yeah. yeah. Cardinal. Oh, it was bling. You're going to have to explain cardinal directions. Uh, I'm uncertain what you mean. The story ends. The story ends, as in, the story ends, whose name is Story Ends in the chat, not that this story <laughs> is ending, has asked if you can get the curses removed from the dice. Yes, you can. Yeah. And uh, we will show you how, shall yeah. we? Tell you how. Yeah, well, I, in fact, I have some items that will get rid of a curse. Oh, have you? But. But if you're new to the game, a more, uh, so, um, a more common way of getting rid of curses is to go to town. Yeah, so you can go to little towns here, and you can use your gold. Unfortunately, we've got lots of gold. Yeah. So you can rest, because as you can see at the moment, our stamina is only one. So, that's so no good. it's not good. So we need to rest for a gold piece. Mm -hmm. But the innkeeper sees that you are the hero of Fire Top Mountain, allows you to rest the inn for free. But that, that's because I killed Sagor and the dragon ah. so there so because it's kind of in the middle of the game uh, you kind of got your reputation uh, builds and builds we are a hero so you can yeah you start getting yeah. freebies so we're getting freebies but if you haven't defeated yes. Zagor then so, you wouldn't so we got that for free which was nice of them mm. so you can rest and then you can heal for 10 mm -hmm. uh, gold pieces it might be the same again there you go um, the healer refuses to take payment because you're the hero for a top mountain. Ah, that's kind. What can I say? And then um, we've rested. So we're all rested and we healed. So uh, the cursed dice, you can't get rid of the cursed dice in towns. You need to go to special places. Yeah. So is it is it worth going over that? For the luck, for the luck dice. Yeah, so we'll show you. So Luke Town, we'll show you how to get rid of your so cursed luck dice. Yeah. So Stonebridge. Not Stone Bridge. We're heading towards Port Black Sands as well as our head. I can never remember where this is. Tell you who. Well, I think it's around here. There's some signs. There you go. That's Port Black Sand. It's Port Black Sand. Port Black Sand. Is it in Port Black Sand? Uh, there, there's a lady there who gets rid of curses for you. Oh, there's another place where you can go as well, isn't there? Is it? Mmm. Another little town, but I can't remember where it is. Yeah, but well, go on, let's, we're going right. to go into Port Black Sand because that's another <laughs> okay, iconic Thank you, I was, I was about to ask. Okay, as you approach the main gate, you are confronted, confronted, confronted by two guards. One of them says, uh, Who would enter Port Black Sands uninvited? State the nature of your business or go back the way you came. But you must tell him you wish to be, you may tell him you wish to be taken to. Mm -hmm. Nicodemus. Thank you. <laughs> tell him that you've, or tell him that you have sold the booty, or attack them. I think we should just attack because we've been doing a lot of attacking. Oh yes. <laughs> and attack. Radium whiskey's always attack, 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 to attack, it. Attack, Ray, attack. thanks, Radium whiskey. Just attack. We're attacking. It's a game of attack. Oh, we're just first of all going to roll to see if, if um, they can get they the warning bell. bell. Oh, they've rang the warning <laughs> bell. The bell rings loudly. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Good job, we're strong. 
Just a look. And show you dual tap. Are you already taking over? Yeah, I'll take over. You read those. Thank you very much. Oh, how did I get none? <gasps> Dice are rigged. Come on, cheese tower. Come on. Come on, on. Come on cheese. Tap. Two. Oh, shit. Cheeky sausage. Who's a cheeky sausage? Raging whiskey and ensure to double tap. I don't think I think that's more of a first person shooter reference than any, you know, what nice did, what, gentle, you know, fighting fantasy, what did, fantasy reference. What did Raging Whiskey say? Uh, uh, attack and ensure to double tap is a, is a reference to shooting them twice. Uh. <laughs> Now then, um, do we want to see? We could upgrade our luck, mm -hmm. but that would just get rid of the cursed dice. Ah, that's oh, good. Oh, we could go upgrade the skill. So I think maybe upgrade the skill. Sure. And then just because we, we've got cash to get rid of exactly. the cursed dice. Exactly. We've got money to get rid of the cursed dice. Yeah. So we don't want to upgrade luck to but get if, rid of the cursed but dice. When you're playing it, it, if you're stuck, you can, uh, when you get an EXP, you can use that to get rid of your curses as well. Which yeah. Is yeah. When you're playing turret. It is. Top tip. Yeah, top tip. Oh, oh we're gonna fight again. And we're gonna fight. Come on. Come on, double tap. <laughs> Come on. So but we're stronger now because we've upgraded our strength. We're still only getting three. Nearly done. Oh there you've got a shield as well, which should protect you from uh, one of the hits. That's true. We picked up a shield earlier in the game. Oh another shield. Shields. Doing well with our shields. Yay. More guards arrive, so we dash into the city to avoid any more conflict. Scarpa! Run! Here we go. So now we're in uh, the port of Black Sands. So now we can so we go explore. Market Street, Clock Street, or Key Street? Key, Market, or Clock Street. Let us know and we'll do another draw. Should we do another draw? That's that sounds like yeah. yeah. Yes, that sounds like very so good. We're going to do another draw whilst you decide which way to go. So, Key, um, Market, or Clock. Uh, anybody who's sitting in the chat and hasn't said anything, just just, just say say something, you know, Key, Market, Clock, whatever you fancy, and uh, um, you'll get entered into a hat. And then in about five to ten minutes, we will do another draw for a copy of Outland Solitaire. Yep. Whee! So, oh, we've got a couple of suggestions. So Cheshire Cat Girl says key. It's the first one in with key. Oh, so it's the, sto the story end says key as well. Oh, two keys, one clock. So We're sorry, going key. Sorry, Twas Bring. Actually, it's a good idea because we are looking for a key. Ooh, yes, good point. What oh, kind, uh, Junk Farmer asks what kind of hat. It's just it's just like a, an electric hat that um, uh, tallies all the names. And then we press a button and it draws one out. So it's just like a, it's like a, it's a raffle. It's a f fictional hat. Yeah, it's a raffle. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna go into this house. I'm gonna go into this house. Ooh, it's a nice house. Look, it's got that checkered like, bed again. <laughs> I swear that was broke oh, when yes. I first saw it. Inside the house. Uh, sorry. Yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Inside the house, an old man sits in a chair, beckons you to sit on the bed. So would you like to sit or leave? I want to lie on the bed. Remembering it's an old man beckoning for you to, you know, sit on the bed with you. And we're a cheese, <laughs> cheese throwing mermaid. Yeah, yeah, with a sword. <laughs> Try that me. Oh, is it dead? Yeah, we're gonna sit on the bed, <laughs> definitely. Okay. Oh no. In an almost inaudible voice, the man says he will heal all your wounds for just the three gold pieces. Yep, we'll pay him. We're yeah. going to pay him. We've got loads of money. We're rich. You watch transfixed as he holds his hands over your wounds, which then disappear before your eyes. Ooh. You thank the man for his help. And oh, leave. he was a nice man after all. Yeah, that's I thought it was going to be dodgy. <laughs> oh, now what have we got? <laughs> One of the locals of Port Blacksand tries to grab your attention. Beggar. You see a beggar in the street. He is sitting on the floor and he holds an empty tin in his hand. Give him a cash. Give him, give him a cash. Give him a penny. No, we're being nasty. But a uh, poor beggar. No. Uh. No. <laughs> we're being nasty in this game. Uh. We are a nasty cheese throwing mermaid. <laughs> Don't forget. Oh like dear, Cheshire Cat Girls are saying, throw some cheese at him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That'd be great. <laughs> yeah, because he could he'd be hungry. He would, yeah. That's yeah, a good yeah. idea. Yeah, throw some cheese. Yeah. Don't spend it on booze and drugs. No, yes, cheese. exactly. <laughs> Don't waste my gold. Um, you that. spot the leader of the Red Star Gang who says you will, he will kill you one-handedly. Really? 
I'd like to see him try. <laughs> we are a cheese throw mermaid. Have you not heard of us? Okay, here we go. Fighting, we're fighting. That should be the saying. Cheese throw mermaid. You've got two cheese. sayings now. You have to pick one, Bex. Cheese throw mermaid. We'll, we'll, we'll stick with ball balls. <laughs> Oh, that was easy. Yeah, it's because I'm totes OP. Oh, they demand that you pay tax of two gold or attack. Right, we're attacking. We're no, attacking. No, no. no. Don't pay the gold. You pesky thieves. You know, you know who I am? Uh oh. Ah, oh, so the story ends asks Is there plans to do expansions for this game or is it currently staying as a standalone? Um, at the moment, it's a standalone game. But it is three in one. There's three, yeah, game. it's three books in one. But we are doing further developments under this license. So hopefully, yes, fun. yeah, definitely. But you, you didn't hear that from us, right? The small boy. If we asked him, if we would like to pay him, no. no. We don't always, like small boys. They always give you poison stuff. They're like, oh, I'm so cute and innocent. <laughs> yeah, and they do that in real life. <laughs> My son does that. <laughs> small boys are never sweet and innocent. Right, where are we going? Right, we'll do a draw now. And oh. then whilst we're doing the draw, you tell us in the chat if we want to go right or left. So let's do a raffle. Two, two, which I suppose there's only two directions now because it was a bit confusing last yeah. time. That's it. Right or left? Right or left. Here we go. So if um, oh, if you had a chat, here we go. And we shall do a roll when I see the button. Can I do because didn't the roll? Yeah, the roll. Is that when you click? I don't know. You tell me. At this rate, everyone will be getting one. Oh, Cheshire Cat Girl! Cheshire Cat Girl, well done! You've you got have, a Wetland Solitaire! You have probably a Wetland Solitaire since we figured out how to use it. <laughs> how to use the hat. Copy of Wetland Solitaire for Cheshire Cat Girl. Woohoo! Well done! Well done! So I'll pop that to you in a, when I figure out Gareth's computer, because he has his setup word. You always find that when you go on other people's computers, and you just kind of like, yeah. Why do you have this here? This is nuts. <laughs> Why do you have this here? It's nuts. Yeah, that's not helpful. Okay, so where are we going? Where I'm gonna have a look on the chat, see where we're going. Oh, that's well. Oh, I can't. Has anyone said right or left? I can't read from here. There we go. If I say left, you go right. That's true. Because we get we can we get confused which way is which. Um, so oh. so Twas Brain says the lower person on the right looks scary and threatening. So go right. So go right. We're going right. So here we go. Oh yay! That haven't got that land. Oh excellent! I'm, I enjoy that. Cheshire Cat. Yeah. Girl. It's quite addictive. It's quite good fun. That was on to DLC Wheel of Cheese. <laughs> I can't go right, Mandy, you got my mouse. Oh, sorry. Poor oh, cheese throwing mermaid cannot move. <laughs> For she has no mouse to eat her cheese. It's like that. Well, you squeaked at least in the right place. <laughs> I go off the body language. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, roughly know what you mean. <laughs> okay, we approach a small circle of people. Standing around a bare-chested man, mm. he is enormous, and his muscles look as hard as iron. Oof. Okay. He's asking the crowd for volunteers to play catch with a cannonball. He says whoever drops the cannonball must pay the other however many gold pieces they want to risk. Should we take him on? Sure. We're yeah, taking yeah. everybody on. Though, though, though I'll tell you what, who I mean, throws a cannonball around in a, in a busy city square? Oh, they could be children health and safety or cats and dogs <laughs> right how many we've got to choose how many gold pieces we want to bet and then we've got to take it in turns to roll a basic skill die 
first player to roll an X drops and loses, so we don't want to roll the X, do nope. we? So, um, How many? Come on, let's bet some gold. Go How 10, many? 10, 10, 10. Don't go too much. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna I bet. I saw the goal. I'm gonna I saw bet the loads. Goal. I'm gonna bet loads because After having had this is Manda's game. <laughs> Just halfway through the game, I'm gonna bet all the gold. Don't, Twenty-five. Don't bet all the gold. I need that to buy bandages. Yeah, I'm betting all the gold. Oh, right, okay, so we're so all right. Twenty-five attention, gold. Attention. This is more than Manda's gold. She'll never let me be in charge again. Okay. <laughs> You, you'll be fine keeping me in a minute. Oh, <laughs> come on, strong man. Roll an X, roll an X. <gasps> Ooh, That's close what was close? <gasps> I really like the dice that oh. one. I should have done this. It's really sweet. 25 gold. Go on. Get the sweat on. <laughs> ah! <laughs> So this is uh, one of the ladies who can remove a curse. Oh, the fortune teller. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we definitely could pay a gold. Here we go. Got to so get rid of all this gold. Yeah. <laughs> Mamma's got too much gold. Let's just get rid of it. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. So I'll let you press the button. Right. We're going to... Remove the curse. Remove the curse. Which oh, yes. Which ten, ten gold. Okay. And we're going to read the fortune because that for costs it. money too. Yeah. Here we go. Looking into the crystal world, so she seems to go into a trance. Ooh. Okay. The answer you seek can be found beneath a bridge to the north. Oh, oh what mystical words. What answer are we after? Where's my bum and keys? <laughs> yeah, where, yeah. Did, where did all my money go? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that was the question I had this morning. Where's my keys? I can't find my keys. <laughs> and she looks away from her crystal ball and asks you to leave. Her face seems to be hiding something. Has she seen some dreadful fate awaiting you? You mm -hmm. Oh, we can't kill her. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> can't kill her. That seems to be what everybody seems to do. Just go yeah. around killing everything. Shall we go in the right? Towards yeah. the right? Yeah, yeah, sounds good to me. Yeah? Come on then. Let's find something else to kill. I've seemed to have awoken a bloodlust in you. So <laughs> Let's go kill the dwarves, Bex. And Bex is like, no, Amanda, don't. And now it's just like that. Kill everything! Here we go. Sure. Sit in the chair. Should we sit in the chair? Sit in the chair. We're going to sit in the chair. It looks a bit old, that chair. You notice something slithering across oh, the floor. Yes. And before you can get your feet, get to your feet, you'll see uh, in the half light that you're encircled by six snakes, each a meter long. Yes! Yes! We get attack! <laughs> the snakes! Attack! Attack! Kill! 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 Ooh, snakes inflict double damage due to their poison Oof, attack. They're nasty. And they're quite big as well. Look at the size of those. They're a bit like, have you been watching I'm a Celebrity? They're a bit like the size of the snakes on I'm a Celebrity. <laughs> I haven't watched I'm a Celebrity. You haven't, um, isn't I'm, I'm, Boris I'm, Johnson's dad? Uh, in? Yeah, that's right. I'm, I'm an episode behind. I don't watch it. Oh, I don't watch it at all. So, uh, okay. so, so you're ahead of me. Yeah, Boris Johnson's dad's in there. Anyone else watch I'm a Celebrity? Is it just me? <laughs> I love yeah. it. I watch it every year. Do you know it's been on for 17 years? Uh, I'm a Celebrity. Yeah, really. I've watched every series. How sad is that? So, that, so that's been going since 2000. Then I'm a Celebrity. Nope. Yeah, must have been. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And they keep finding celebrities. I know. Well, to be fair, they're getting a bit... Mm. Not exactly A-list celebrities, are they? Well, they never were, though, to be fair. Yeah. Oh, I just defeated them. George Decay was on it a while back. That yeah. was kind of fun. Yeah, the song He's an A-list celebrity, yeah. in my opinion. Yeah. Oh, Amir Khan, the boxer's in it. He's pretty... Mm. Celebrity status. Oh, mm. we've come across some city guards. Okay, don't attack them. Because they keep coming. They yeah, we're going to attack them! <laughs> Yay! Kill! We're going to attack them! Because <laughs> they're, they're, they're quite, as, as, as monsters go, these are quite interesting because they do, they do just keep coming. 
Because yeah, you will attack one and then you have to do uh, like a luck roll to see if another luck come, come ah. along. And since since my luck's really low, you'll probably get another one. Manda. We'll be here forever next! <laughs> we'll be here forever! We're going to attack them. Yeah, we're getting good XP. We're getting stronger. I see it. I'm helping you. Right. <laughs> so yeah. Spending all your money. Roll. I come, I come back into Port Black Sands and they're like, oh, you! And I'm like, it wasn't me! <laughs> yeah, I wasn't me! She wasn't, she wasn't in control! <laughs> Oh, luckily, no more guards are there. Oh, there we go. There we go, we did well. God, you're a Jenny. I know. Oh, there you go. <laughs> so, tw uh, Twasbring says, Ariel didn't upgrade those skill drives for nothing. Attack everything! Yeah! We're gonna <laughs> kill him. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! You feel a slight tug at your coin purse. Uh-oh, I feel more gold disappearing. <laughs> Someone has stolen our gold. <laughs> well, Manda's gold. Yes. My, ha my hard-earned yeah, cash. Mainly me. Uh, roll four dice and lose one gold for each break. Let's do three gold. Ah. Lost three gold. If I can come away with <laughs> at least <laughs> ten, that's okay. <laughs> the house to your right has a door with six skulls painted on it. Mm. One black and five white. Quite ominous. Uh oh. Should we go inside? I tell you what, um, there's some baseball going on up here, which I, I never actually really did. Oh, didn't you? No, I've no. done the baseball. I Because I've, I've heard you can, you can get some neat stuff. Oh no, not the coiled <laughs> roof again. I hate this one. Here we go. Come on. Oh, it's alright with the weak. Two. Get in. Yeah, we're alright. Coiled rope. No problem. Because I, I, but yeah, I never really did the baseball thing. Oh, didn't you? No, no. Oh, I so, did. So, uh, we were going to do some baseball. Some, some baseball. Who Not baseball. wants to play some baseball? Some baseball. Baseball. Baseball? Spaceball. Spaceball. Let's keep saying this word until it loses all meaning. <laughs> right, we're going to go. We're going to play some baseball, guys. Who likes baseball? Whoop, whoop with these fiends. So we're going to join in. There's a group of brown creatures. It's very descriptive that, isn't it? Brown creatures. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. It's not really good, that. Here we go. Ian Livingston, that's not a good enough description. <laughs> brown creatures. I expect more. There we go. You take the stick and face a creature who throws the lava ball at you. You will win the game for the team if you pass the skill test. Ooh! Right. So we so we could automatically we could use one of the skill potions and also, Shall we? Yeah, yeah, go for it. Come on. We're gonna see what happens when we skillfully I've not done this. hit the ball. We hit, hit, hit ball. it powerfully into the distance. Slugger. Slugger! Yay. We're a slugger. So I've got an achievement. Yay. Oh, achievement yeah. unlocked. Sporting, Sporting behaviour. Behavior. The team rush over to you and are overjoyed at their victory. Supporters run over and start handing you gifts. Eventually, Ooh. you manage to wiggle free and head back to the street. Well done, well done. So, what gifts? What, uh, what Eight gold pieces. Ooh, and, and a, a bottle of liquid. Labelled Mind Control Potion and a Ooh. bunch of bananas, which you eat. Mind Control? Are you going to use that on me now, Amanda? To stop, stop <laughs> spending my money. Stop uh, attacking uh, things. Cancel the effect of a spell being cast on them. Ooh, that's good. Yeah. We did get lots of goodies there. I've never, I've, I've never done that before. I, I think because I, I always uh, tr attempted that very, very early in the game. Yeah. So I always fail it and they all kind of uh, get all angry at you. <laughs> so I never bother. Someone asked about um, the YouTube on the chat earlier and I Ooh. forgot to ask. YouTube. No, YouTube. About the. Um, Give me more balls. So yes, so the, the phrase is give me ball balls. Yeah, give me uh, ball balls. And put that in the YouTube comment section when this video has been put archived yeah. onto YouTube. So, so don't don't say now, say later. And you oh, I see. Draw. So don't put it in the chat now for YouTube. Yep. Once we finish streaming mm -hmm. and the video has been archived into our page, mm -hmm. um, put the chat in there, give me ball balls, and then they'll be entered into the draw for next week. Mm -hmm. That's how it works. So everybody on Twitch as well, if you want to go to our YouTube channel, mm -hmm. which is I think Nomad Games, mm -hmm. check it out. Um, you can answer as well. Leave a comment. Mm. Oh, Geeky Shappy. Hello, Geeky Shappy. Hi. Uh, I never got the baseball thing when reading it before. 
Only when it was read aloud now. I just got it. <laughs> Excellent. We're going to go in here because there's some wheels outside. Woo! You return to the blacksmith who looks hard at work making more horseshoes. You decide to leave him to it and okay. continue north. Bye! Ooh, I like the so, sheep. Oh, hey! I made the sheep. Oh, not, did you? Not, not personally. I'm going in the shop to spend some gold. Ka ching! That's alright. I quite like the uh, pawnbroker. We're going to buy some stuff. You might be interested in my crate of mystery. Ooh. Over the year, I have had many adventurers like yourself come into my shop and sell things that they found from all over the land. Ooh, very certain. So it's like a lucky dip. I like Ooh. lucky dips. For a mere 10 gold pieces, you may reach into my crate and pull oh, out hello. one item. Hmm? What? You could don't pay and beat her up. It's not giving you the option. Oh. The option. <laughs> you hand over 10 gold pieces and reach into the crate. Fishing around with your hand, you Could grab something. 16 gold pieces! 16! Yay! Right. That's good. Nice return investment. Let's buy again. An I ROI, isn't it? Yeah. Awesome. yeah. There you go. Crate buy of again. mystery. Look. And silver throwing dagger. A silver throwing dagger. Didn't you need that in your quest? Need, yeah, so that will. That will. Woohoo! I did a quest! Thank you very much. How long uh, did that take us? It took us, what, an hour, an hour, hour a bit, to and quest. managed to complete, complete a quest. Not the quest we set out to do, <laughs> but a quest. So I'll take it. There we That's go. good. So we shall carry on going until we run out of cash. Let's carry on going until we come out of Port Black Sand. Oh, there we go. Pull. Oh, we're running. Oh, you're, spending, you're even spending all your own money now. <laughs> oh, uh, the, the, the lucky dip. I find a bit addictive. It is a bit addictive, lucky dips. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow, look Ooh, at those. Sandals. We can fly with our feet. The mermaid hasn't got money. Yeah, she's got feet. I've yeah, seen her yeah, walking. Yeah. Only when she's in water. Yes. It's aerial. Get a tail. Indeed. So, 20 XP. Ooh. Dice right, upgrade. Dice upgrade. Oh, so, which one do you think should upgrade? I, I always go for. Brutality, Steel. because we're attacking a lot. <laughs> so we need that. Yeah. Okay. So we're skill. Flying. Crate of mystery. So last gold piece. <laughs> You're a real shopaholic, you are, yeah. aren't you? <laughs> the shopkeeper looks into his crates and sees that it is empty. <laughs> Come back to soon shop. for more mystery items, he says. You've emptied the shop. Oh, I'm sure he doesn't mind. Uh, He'll be there like that. Yes, to the pub! <laughs> is this what you like, Christmas shopping? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. I have to curb myself that, slightly. I love that, I love that, I love that. It, well, well, the thing with Christmas shopping is because you're buying for other people, yeah. you can go, you can go. oh, I'll buy this because it's dead nice. <laughs> it's not for me. It's for, the, it's for my friends and family. Yeah. So that works quite well. Yeah. I quite, 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 quite like Christmas shopping. Yeah. So uh, you see two huge guards wearing the black uniform of Lord Azur. Ooh. As they get, uh, as you, they get closer, you see that they are trolls, brutal, menacing, Ooh. brutal mercenaries. mercenaries thank yeah. you. Employed by the Lord Azur as Imperial elite guards. Ooh. You see a tree which is almost as tall as the city. So would you, would you want to walk past the guard or climb the tree? We want to kill the guards. <laughs> kill the guards. Didn't upgrade their skill dice for nothing. Yeah. The child suspects something about something odd about you. What about me? How rude. No, me That's never. Rude. A mermaid gone, you know, elf. <laughs> mermaid cheese thrower. Not That's strange odd at all. all that. <laughs> They ask where you live, and you reply that you are in Port Black Sands on a tra trading mission. They laugh scornfully and <laughs> ask to see your <laughs> merchant's pass. <laughs> have we got one? No, we have We beat up the guys at the end. <laughs> oh, yeah. You fumble around in your backpack, realising that you do ah. not have a merchant's pass. I got one! A bit of cardboard, just wave it about. Library card! Yeah. Uh, the larger of the two guards uh, tells you that you are under an arrest. For being in Port Black Sands without authorization. Oh. He tells you that he's feeling generous, however, and offers you a choice. You can pay a fine of all the gold you have and be throughout the city, or spend a year with rats and cockroaches in a dark dungeon cell. So do you pay or resist? Resist. <laughs> resist. Although we do want to get rid of all your money. Yeah. No, that yeah, was my no, quest no. at the beginning of the game. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it, was a, it was a hidden hidden agenda, was yeah, a hidden yeah. quest. The guards seem happy to fight you. Ah! Oh, ooh, fight, he's fight, a brute. Fight, 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 fight. Here we go. He's 11, that sour belly. Oh, shake the dice. Come on, give him a good shake. Four. Oh. Uh, 
and the shield, so that, that should only hit one off. Oh, okay. So I'll do two more. Oh, crap, crap. Oh, wrong side. I was looking at the other totally. Oh, what a silly person. There we go. So, three. 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 Ooh. Come on, Sour Belly. Ooh, he's looking weaker. Come on. <gasps> there you go. Is that four? Four. Uh, four in the shield. Four in the shield. Mm. That's not too bad. So that will be around to 13. Protect us as by one dice. And I've got that healing uh, potion as well, so that should be, yeah, we should yeah. get this. This should be easy. Fat Nose! They've got great names, the characters <laughs> in this book. We should have on to the um, City of Chaos. I think, I think it's City of Chaos, you know, with all the like the. Citadel of Chaos. Yeah, with all the weird things splinched yeah. together. They're quite fun. I'll go there next. If we have time. What think, time is it? I think, I, think this, this I think we might be able to roll it, wrap it up in a minute. Time's tramping on. It is. <laughs> Beck's favourite game. Be a prize. Oh, <laughs> as well. I'd be here to the bitter end. Here we go. Oh, four. That's four. Mm. Oh, come on, dice. Go on. Oh, yes. We've got it. Hey. Some nearby beggars cheer when you cut down old fat but one sly looking character calls for some guards and soon you hear the thundering of heavy boots approaching from the east. Scarper! Ah! A large group of guards comes into view. Uh, they are heading towards you. There are too many for you to take on. You decide it's quicker to... Scarper. Scarper. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. So there you go. Put plats on. All that just to get rid of uh, X on my dice. <laughs> <laughs> The potion, yeah, and the uh, uh, winged, yeah, shoes. So, winged shoes, that's, that. that's yeah. all right, pretty, pretty good turnover. So, that was a little uh, introduction to Lapland Solitaire and Fighting Fantasy Legends. Mm. So, so a double whammy. So, so we think, shall we post the links? We'll place the links on the chat for, um, for the various Wesmans. So, that would be a good idea. And we'll do one more raffle so before yes. we go as well. So, yes, so same again. If, if anybody's in the chat who hasn't said anything, t type into the chat and you'll yeah. get put into the hat. So yeah, write in the chat now, anything, doesn't matter, and then you'll get put in the draw to win a copy of Lapland Solitaire. Because we're in the giving spirit, because it's get, Christmas. Get you into the Christmassy, get you into yeah. a nice Christmassy mood. Ooh, the bundle. The Lapland. Lapland mm. Solitaire. So uh, this it's a good one. game. That one. So that's Fighting Fantasy. So next week um, we will be streaming some more Talisman. So we will be looking for people to join in. Uh, six player game. So please get in contact with us and uh, come play. Um, we also will be looking more closely at the Harbinger mm -hmm. next week as well. Yeah. With with because uh, hopefully we should be able to you know release that this side of this year. Hopefully the Harbinger will be out for Christmas, that that is, Amanda said, so is. we might have some Uber breaking development news next Thursday if you want to tune in then. Um, and yeah, I was going to add a little request as well. Mm -hmm. I don't know if anybody plays Horace, Talisman the Horus Heresy, um, but I was wondering if you play it on Steam, iOS or Android, if you could leave us a little review, in fact for any of our games, we'd really like it. As Horus Heresy has been getting mixed reviews on Steam, we were like positive <laughs> for months and months and then all of a sudden it's gone down to mixed again. Yeah. So if you play Talisman the Horus Heresy and you like it, please do leave us a little review because it does help with any of our games actually. Yeah, it definitely does. Yeah, even if it's just a few words. So absolutely. Absolutely fantastic. That would this? be really good. So shall we do another quick Lapland Solitaire so let's draw? Do, yeah, we're going to do another draw to win a copy of Lapland Solitaire. Uh, well, there's a thing. So do the thing and make sure nobody else is snuck on. No, yeah, we do. who could it be? Who's it roll. gonna be? Ooh, drum gear, roll! Gear 1989! Woohoo! Gear 1989! You're well a winner! Done. Hooray! Woohoo! You're now a proud owner! Proud of oh, Lapland Solitaire! Well, you will be in a minute for Steam. When I. Yeah. For Steam, yes, I suppose that's, yeah. that's important. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's a Steam key <laughs> giving away. Yeah, right, I'm going, you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 That, that's all dead. Oh, like, oh, I can't get it on my phone. Like, they're expecting yeah. to post, you know. <laughs> yeah. I thought you said I'd get Lapland Solitaire. Yeah. It's like a card. It's only, it's, it's, only, it's, only, it's only a digital game, I'm so sorry. <laughs> so, gear, gear 1989. Where are we? Oh, yeah, 
Let's have a look on the chat. Oops, the chat. Great. So we'll send you a private message yeah, and send yeah. that key. So I think, is, is, there, everyone nick it. is there anything else that we need to mention before um, we stop streaming? Well, do you know what I'm going to do? Something that we've not actually ever done before, I don't think. Okay. We're going to post a Lapland Solitaire key in the chat. Oh, all right. First one to grab it. How about that? Give do it a whirl. You don't get that with Gareth, do you? <laughs> so we're going to do that now. You, you ready? First one to grab a copy okay. of Lapland Solitaire on Steam. Ho, 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 Merry Christmas for us. First one to grab it. Let us know if you get it, by the way, as well. There you go. So, there you go. Anyway. Quick, quick, quick. Thank you very much uh, yeah. for uh, sitting with us. It's always, always fun to have a chat. It is. Have a chat with you guys. And it's always good fun. Next week we'll do Frost March, as well as a Harbinger. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a good yeah, idea. And it'll probably yeah. be our last stream before Christmas next week as well. I so, please join us for our last Christmas Definitely, definitely. We'll make what? it as thematic as possible. Yeah. Get, get Christmas hats oh, on. Oh, I forgot to bring the Christmas tree. We'll bring the Christmas tree. <laughs> we'll have treats. We'll have cho virtual chocolate coins <laughs> for everybody. Yes. Yeah. Thank you very much. And it'll be the last stream in 2017. Cheers, so, guys. Thanks for watching. See you in a bit. Bye.